Hi everyone, I'm Callie Wally. Welcome back to the second episode of The Witcher 3. I've been really, really excited to get back into the game today. I was really overwhelmed with all of the positive comments on the last video. Thank you to all of the new subscribers and the comments and the likes on my last video. There were a lot of comments to hang out in the White Orchard area because it's kind of a tutorial zone for uh, new players like me. So we're going to hang out in White Orchard today and see where it takes us. This bard's tale begins near White Orchard with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore, the sorceress Yennefer. She'd eluded him for years, but now seems just a few steps ahead. After many trials and tribulations, Geralt finally learned that Yen was in nearby Vizima. Okay, so we figured out where Yen was last time. Um, we talked to that really uh, rude officer guy, and we also killed the griffin. So we're going to head back to White Orchard. Um, it says prepare to leave, but we're going to pick up all of the side quests and do some of the adventuring today. Oops. I wonder if Roach is nearby. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Are there any side quests to do around here? I think I might just fast travel back to, uh, oops, sorry. Okay. <laughs> I might just travel back to White Orchard. Let's see. There is like a side quest here. I'm just not sure where Roach is. Does it show me on my map? I don't see him. Maybe if we go back to, uh, like the town area, we'll find Roach. Maybe we left him in town. Okay, there he is. Nice. So it is 9.57 at night. I've never done this, but I know that you can meditate. Let's see. Just looking at all of my buttons real quick. These are some of the quests that we took. Let's see, Witcher Contract. We could take this. In White Orchard, Gerald happened across a notice posted by a certain Odolin residing in the village. The man wanted someone to take out the monster who was haunting the area around an old well, and doing so required a professional. This was a typical of butcher work they come, so Gerald decided to talk to the man. Okay, let's track it. That's one of the contracts that we apparently took. Here's meditation. I think I might just meditate till the morning. Like 6 a.m. I think this also helps your health go up. I remember reading that last time. Okay. All right. So let's look at the map and see where the quest is. Is this it? Devil by the well. Yep. Okay. Faster. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I could just ran over that little boy. Watch out, he's run, Roach. It's Durban now. The NPCs scripts are just they're so good in this game. Okay, looks like he's over here. In this building, maybe. Yeah, Odolin. Greetings, good man. Having trouble with your well? That's what I read. Aye, tis haunted. Has been for a good twenty years. Twenty? So why do you put out a notice just now? Because earlier on we drew our water from the river. But so many corpses floating in it after the battle has turned noxious. Oh. My daughter Mandy drank half a pitcher. Felt dreadful ill. Can't keep nothing down. She grows worse by the day. Herbalist claims you fight a fever with drink. And not beer nor cider, but water. Clear, pure water. And where am I to get that if not from the well? But first, the ghost's got to be driven away. And it don't let any man near. Mm hmm. 
Describe the ghost. This ghost. Describe it for me. Well, it's awful frightening. Awful. I meant, what does it look like? It looks like a woman, but fresh from the grave. Wears a dirty dress, all rags, its skin flaking off its bones. Mm. And it howls like it's suffering. Some wraith, or maybe an alp. If you don't wallop it, master. If you don't take care of it, that is, it'll come kill me daughter. No. Um, let's talk about my reward. I'll help you. Fine, I'll help. Where's this well? In Havel. A settlement on the heights. It's abandoned now. No one ventures there on account of the ghost being about. Drive it off. Please. How am I supposed to kill a ghost? Okay, contract devil by the well. Find the spirit that haunts the well. All right. There's some like herbs and stuff around here. So that's what the leaves are. They're like herbs. I didn't know what they were last time. I thought they were like side quests or something, but it actually tells you where to get um, different ingredients. Let me just pick some up. It's very cool. I love the alchemy in this game. All right. Come on, Roach. All right. Looks like it's about 260 meters out. I wonder if that head will always be on Roach. <laughs> the griffin head that we took. I thought that one guy was supposed to take it. But it's still just like chilling on the back of Roach. Run, Roach. Oh, there we go. That's how we run. Wait. There we go. The infamous well. Okay, it's so it's in this area. Ghost. Maybe it only shows at a certain time of day. Oh, maybe it's only at night or something. Mm, what is that? Like a dog? Okay. Maybe we could like search in here. I'm not sure if they keep like loot and stuff. Oh, look, there's a chest. Nice. Here's another chest. There's a bag back there. Can I jump in there? Alchemist powder, linen. Nice. I know linen's good for crafting, I think. Like crafting armor. What's this? Looks like a furnace or something. Oh, it's just a dresser. Let me get back here. Maybe we can sell the platter to somebody. Vial, vial. Nice. The loot in this game kind of reminds me of like Skyrim. You can take plates and stuff and uh, vials. I'm sure the vials come in handy when you're trying to make alchemy potions though. Wait, no, loot that. What time is it? 7.30 a.m.? Okay, so we'll probably have to like meditate till night. Have we gone in here already? What is this book? A yellow diary? Journal. Hmm. Might be useful. 27, 3, 12, 50. It's happened. Volker sent a petition of our grievances against the Lord to the court of Azinava. Listed all the harm he's done to us. How he killed Johan for not taking off his cap quickly enough. <gasps> How he trampled our fields when drunk with Neri, a thought of repayment. How he barged in during Peter's wedding and demanded his right of the first night. Ugh. Now we finally got what we begged, Matil. 
uh, Melitel for in our prayers for so long. The judge recognized our grievances and waived all our bonds and duties to the Lord. We can finally strike out on our own. At last, we can live as free men. The first day of our freedom, Havel's not much of a village yet, but to my mind, it's better than the most fantastic place. Volker fumed our home with the hazelwood smoke to drive out evil, buried a Martin under the gate to make sure no thieves cross our threshold. And then he gave me a bracelet, loveliest I've ever seen. Mother said it's foolish to spend so much time on the bauble when we haven't plows nor hoes that we have ought to return to the merchant over my dead body. I'll never take it off. It's always been there to remind me of Volker, of how happy we were that day. They say the Lord is coming to see us, that he wants to make a deal to beg us to return to the village. They said he's calmed down, calmed since his son died, that he's not as quick to anger about small slights. We'll see. One way or another, I have no intention to move one inch from here. Interesting. You think it was like the... But he said it was a woman, so it couldn't have been the lord or the priest. Anything else in here? Can I take things off the shelf? No. Nope. Okay. I think that's everything in here. All right, so we can just wait until nighttime, maybe? Find the spirit that haunts the well. There is like the well here. <laughs> I don't know if we can jump down there. Grass around the well scorched. Anything else? Bodies dried to a crisp. Signs of burns. All signs point to a new wraith. Mm, okay. These are just things. What's this? Is this anything? No. Okay. I wonder if I can just like jump down the well. I don't know. I feel like that's kind of sketchy. Maybe if we use the rope, can we use the rope? I feel like I'm gonna die. Okay, we're down here. We're down here. This isn't a very good fighting area. How am I supposed to get back up? Oh, look at that dead body. Oh no, maybe I shouldn't have jumped down here. Hmm. There's nothing down here. <laughs> How am I supposed to get out? Uh oh. It from here. Mm, can he climb? No. How to get out? Jump. Hmm. You think there's anything down there? Ugh. This is creepy. What's that? Oh, the bracelet. Okay. There's a chest down here too. This thing gives me the creeps. Okay. That's pretty much it. Okay, let's go to the surface. Hmm. Okay, well, I don't know how to get out of here. There's like a couple waterfalls. What else is in here? This area has to be something. Oh, he can't climb up there. Okay. Lucky not to come up empty handed. Bracelet with an inscription to Claire from Volker. 
Bracelet must have belonged to the woman in the well. Yeah, the one that she wrote about. So it was her. She turned into the wraith. The one that was writing the journal entries, it seems. Okay, find the spirit that haunts the well. Okay, so I just have to find my way out now, I think. Let's see what's down here. Okay. All right, so we can get out this way. Here, I'm going to come up for air and then we can get that because I don't know how deep this is. Where am I? <gasps> oh my gosh, it's so scary in here. It's going to be okay. Holy. I can't see anything out there. Okay, let's just keep swimming this way towards the light. <laughs> All of the sounds in here. Oh, I hope I make it. Okay. Hmm. All right. So I think we have to go back to where we came from. Oh, it's raining. I was like, what is that noise? It's thunder. All right. Traveled quite a way. Oh, it's a rabbit. Okay. Here's the village. So I think now we should wait till, till nighttime. We meditate till night. So let's see if we can craft anything um, to help us. Can we make any bombs? Saltpeter, calcium, oils. Apply to sword for additional effects in combat. That would actually be very helpful. Where can we find some of this. I remember we talked to that one lady. Maybe we could go buy some ingredients from her. Attack power versus necrophage. No, she's not. Necrophage. Critical hit chance. Okay, let's just go see if we can find some of these um, Arenaria flowers. And craft some some oils to use on our blade white myrtle okay so I remember there was like that lady that we talked to last time the herbalist yeah let's go back and talk to her maybe she'll have it where's Roach I think he's over here Okay. And then by the time we come back, maybe it'll be like nighttime ish. Oops. I love the music in this game. It's so good. All right. There's a lot of like different plants in that area too. On the way back, we can go pick some. Stock up on all of our herbs. Let's see what this is. Celendria. I feel like I might need to buy like a notebook just for this game. Um, cause it's kind of like Skyrim where I just feel like all the ingredients have different names and in order for me to remember them, it would probably be good to write them down for things that I really need or things that I want to try to find. 
are we allowed to be looting all of this? I feel kind of bad. We're, we're stealing from this lady. <laughs> I don't find, see any of those flowers that we actually need, though. All right, let's see if she has any moliar rib leaf. Okay. Yes. Um, have we asked her her story? Tell me something about yourself. What's your story? A sad one. Do you know the temple of Melitale in Alanda? Do I know it? Can't remember how many times I've been there, how many times Mother Nenica stitched me up. We must have missed each other. I started to become a healer under Mother Nenica. Hmm. I was but 18 when they took me in. An age at which teachings interest one far less than love. There was a boy, Goslath. He'd bear his chest to work. The novices couldn't keep their eyes off him, tripped over their own feet, dropped things. I left the temple for him. We passed a lovely summer together, and then he left. Neneke refused to take me back. <laughs> the eye roll. My parents uttered not a word. Gave me a travel cloak and a small coin pouch. I struggled long to find a place where I'd feel safe, needed. Until I finally arrived here. End of story. All right. Got any herbs you're willing a sad to sell? story. I'm sure I can find something. Okay, let's see if she sells. It was this one. Let's buy all of these from her. Do five coin. That's not bad. Um, I would sell her stuff, but I just don't know what we use and what we won't use. Maybe eventually. Um, we can find some things. Does she already have the oil that we're looking for? She has a Gwent card. <laughs> How much is this? 409? Wait, really? 409 coin. That's like all of our coin. I know you guys told me to buy all of the Gwent cards that I can, but that's really expensive. <laughs> that is expensive. We need to start making some money. What is this? Griffin Dock? Noon Wraith? Limits the duration of knockdown, hypnosis, stun, and blindness. Hmm. What are these? Alchemy formulas? That's actually pretty nice. I feel like I should buy one of those. I don't think we're dealing with a Noon Wraith, though. Dwarven Spirit. White Gull. All right. For right now... Um, Farewell. let's craft this. Let's see. Alchemy. Oils. This one. Okay. You can make one. That's good. I'm not sure how long it lasts. Let's see. So where is it? 20 charges. Okay. Well, can we equip this? Oh, no, we can't equip. How do we use it? Select a slot. Oh, we just put it onto the blade. Okay. Well, let's do that. Accept. Okay. So it's on there. Plus 10% attack power versus specters. Okay. And food... We do have some chicken legs. <laughs> we have raw meat. I wonder if you can cook meat over like fire or something. Put that there. And some water. What is this? Toxicity. Increases attack power. Okay. All right, let's go fight this thing. Apply oils to your sword. Increases the damage it's dealt to a certain opponent. Open the inventory panel. Okay. We got this now. Let's go get this. Let's go give this wraith. I'm trying to remember where that field was with all the. I think it was this one. Viper-eyed Hellraiser. Oh. 
What does that say? Fool's parsley? <laughs> Just stealing all of their crops. <laughs> okay, there's some over here too. I don't know what we'll need any, any of this for. If not, we can just sell it too. Okay. There's Roach. That's cool. Dear, it scared me. Whoa. Okay, so now we just have to wait till night, I think. Okay. All right, we'll wait till nighttime. You have blade oil in your inventory. To use it, apply it to your sword. We already did. Drag the oil to the slot. Now your sword will deal more damage. Okay. So let's meditate till like 6 p.m. I guess. Oh, yep. Okay. Wonder what it's doing here. Let's take out the She's not silver. My goodness. Oh, wrong way. Oh, that was unfortunate. Okay. Am I doing any damage to this girl? Holy. Come over here. Come over here, you crazy devil. Mm. Okay, hopefully that heals us a little bit. I think it is. What are they doing in the house? Get out of the house, devil. did a lot of damage let's go okay so they have to stand in the circle <gasps> let's go something's keeping her here she'll be back tomorrow read the entry about noon wraiths in the bestiary okay how do i do that okay so when she was standing in the circle i was doing a lot of damage how to find the bestiary In this panel, you can browse through the contents of all the books and scrolls you found. Even if you later sell a book, its contents will still be available. Oh, nice. Okay. On the left, you can select books, scrolls, and other letters. Their contents will be shown in the center. Okay. So this is from the... Okay, but how do I find the bestiary? Oh, look at Siri and Yennefer. Here it is. Spectres, devil by the well. Is she flicking off? <laughs> is that her middle finger? Look at the tongue. The residents of White Orchard had suffered more than their fair share of misfortunes. Passing armies had trampled their spring planting. A griffin had begun abducting their livestock. And the rotten icing on the painful cake. A noon wraith haunted a nearby well. Oh, it is a noon wraith. Okay. I thought it was just a regular wraith. 
No wonder the locals called this final evil a devil. The Witcher could sense something bound to her, to this place, and that in order to send her off into the ethereal realms, he would first need to learn her secret. I bet it has something to do with the bracelet. Once they were once once that was done, he would have to prepare for battle, and a noon wraith is a demanding opponent. She can disorient her victim by blinding and creating mirror images of herself. These copies slowly suck their victim's life energy, while their mistress remains untouchable. In order to defeat her, the Witcher could not rely on his silver sword alone. Yeah, the Yurden sign would also need to be need to trap her and force her to take on a material form. Nice. So we learned that. It was a fluke, but we learned that. <laughs> Noon wraiths, despite what's commonly thought, peasants do not interrupt their labor at midday to get out of the sun. They do so to avoid noon wraiths. Vlad Raymond, peasants and their customs. Okay. They're often held in this world by some object or intense emotional sacrifice. That is why if one ever finds a wedding ring or a torn veil in the middle of a field, one should not pick it up, but instead back away as quickly as possible. So she's definitely bound to that bracelet. Something's tied the noon wraith to this place. An object. Something she needs before she'll leave this world. Okay. So find out what binds the noon wraith um, to the ruined village. It's sending me here, but I'm pretty sure we already have the bracelet. Yeah, there's nothing else in here for us. We've already looted all of this. Maybe it wants me to still do it? I don't know. Yeah, we've already been in here. Oh, we didn't loot this chest. Okay. So I think that we should take out the, can I take out the bracelet and like show it to her or something? Where's my inventory? Here it is. Drop. Hmm, I can't just drop it. Interesting. Maybe I have to go through these, I don't know, areas. I'm pretty sure it's the bracelet, though. Has to be. Oh, what's this? A man, stabbed with a knife, died on the spot. Animals fed on his body, picked his skeleton clean. More blood stains over there. But it's not his blood. Hmm. Okay. Blood stains, barely visible. Someone was dragged this way. Someone who was still alive. Well, that's what happened to her. Home prints in blood. Small hands. A woman's. Someone dragged her out. She was wounded. Fought for her life. Hmm. No body in sight, but might still find some tracks. Under the right conditions, bloodstains can remain visible for decades. Another print by the well. Okay. That's the burnt grass. The rope. Bloodstains. Almost faded. But the lines don't. Oh, we weren't supposed to Someone's jump down right. there. <laughs> I got ahead of myself. So of now we're just gonna... By the bucket rope. Okay, that's all right. Woman the journal belonged to. Must be. Wide pelvis, small jaw. A woman. Around 30, judging by the teeth. Left arm's missing. Mm -hmm. Need to cremate the remains. Gotta find the object that binds her to this place before I do, though. Was she wearing the bracelet from her husband? Might be why her arm fell off. Okay, so it wants they want me to burn. Let's take another look. That's the bracelet. Okay, good. Love we don't have to go back down shape. there. 
but I'll have to burn it with the body to get rid of the noon wraith for good. Better do it near the well. Okay. So we're gonna release light a fire to destroy the noon wraith bracelet. For this fight. Okay. Brew some wraith oil. Drink some potions. Wraith oil. How do we make wraith oil? I guess it's just talking about the oil that we already have. Clears toxicity and cancels all active potions. Accelerates vitality regeneration. Ooh, we need some of this. Drowner brain. I'm guessing we get those from those crazy zombie things. Water essence. Okay. What does this do? Grants sight and total darkness increases critical hit chance. Oh, this is so cool. Okay. We'll have to definitely get some ingredients going and brewing. I'm pretty sure we'll be okay. We already have the oil on our blade. So let's get started. Hopefully we'll be fine. <laughs> and the bracelet. Igni. Is that the moon, moon ray? Yep. Mm. Hey, I think it worked. All right, let's get Yarden back out. Wasn't that bad. I think it's because we had She's the oil gone. though, and we knew what to do. Spectre dust, light essence, emerald dust. Nice. And a trophy. Nice. Return to Odolin. Wow, that was a lot of fun. Okay, so now I know not to get ahead of myself in these side quests. Just kind of like follow the dialogue um, and use the Witcher sense instead of just running around and looting like I normally do um, in my RPG games, this game is very like, it's scripted a lot, which is very cool. The cutscenes and stuff are, are really nice. It makes side questing um, very fun, actually. All right, let's go back to Odolin. Get our reward. He's over this way. Anyone want to go and jump in puddles? Can I fit through here? Oh, oh, oh! Yes. Come on. Hey, we can't go this way. <laughs> we cannot go that way. Look at the chickens in the little stew pot. Right. Must be this way. There's another like side quest in this house here. Which I think it was that guy that we almost ran over. <laughs> the wench took down the wash. All right, let's go talk to this guy. Tell him his daughter is now safe. Job done. The well was haunted by the ghost of a woman who was killed there. I drove it away. I just hope every unburied wretch don't start haunting us. Well, that battlefield's gonna cause us a heap of trouble. If they do, you know who to contact. Meanwhile, Claire, Volker, names ring a bell? I don't know him. Though I did hear our herbalist Tamira mention a Claire once. Same one, maybe? Your reward, Master Witcher. The gold I'd hid away for Mandy's dowry. Without you, She'd never have lived to wed. Now, let's hope for it at least. <sighs> I could take the coin, but it's for his daughter. I think that he should keep it. We can make coin. At this point, doubt I'll ever marry. 
You keep the coin from Mandy, her wedding. Raise a toast to my health then. Thank you, Master Witcher. Those warm words. You've a good heart. We can't do this every time. Well, I can't let you go empty-handed. Take this at least. But for those of you um, that are new to the channel, I do have a daughter, um, and she's turning four soon. So I would, I want his daughter to have the money. <laughs> you can keep it. Have a nice wedding. All right, that was fun. That was a really cool uh, side quest. Thank you guys for recommending me doing side quests. I would have probably just kept going with the main storyline for a bit. Um, so thank you for your recommendations. I probably would have skipped this town completely, honestly. All right. So there was another side quest over here with this guy that was um, doing some smithing. Let's go see what he wants. It's right here. Maybe we'll get a good sword out of it. What happened here? Oh, got a wee bit chilling the night, so I set fire to my forge. Got a nice and roaring. Roasted some wieners. What do you think happened, dimwit? Some bugger set a light me in my workshop. I've lost everything. Everything! It's... I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't insult me. Sorry. Any suspects? Whole damned village. I've lived here half a century. Thought they saw me as one of their own. But everything changed when the Black Ones came. I'm the only smith around, so I got to service their garrison. Bang dents out of plate, shoe horses. That sort of thing. And elf guardians don't pay me a bloody copper. Just give me supplies and orders. The humans can't fathom that. They think I'm getting rich off their misfortune. That I sleep on a pile of gold like a plowing dragon. They've stopped talking to me. Spit when I pass. And now this. Hmm. Good luck rebuilding. Farewell. Um, I can find your arsonist. I can we can go beat up an arsonist. Provided you're willing to pay. <sighs> I've not much left. But I'll give you all if you bring me that horse in. So that he gets what he deserves. The night of the fire, I heard movement outside my hut. Went out to see if I could find any tracks. But found nothing. But then I haven't got cat eyes, have I? Good luck. Mm, cat eyes. Okay, that must have been a hint at something. Maybe, possibly. Twisted fire starter. Use your witcher sense to look behind the forge for clues about the arsonist. Okay. I'm gonna take that. <laughs> All right, let's see. That boy is just running around, jumping in all of the puddles. Um, oh, there's something over here. Shavings from a tinderbox. Arsonist must have lit his torch here, tossed it on the roof, then fled through the orchard. Mm. Blueprints. A man's. Large. Mm, go this way. This. Stinks of piss and vodka. <laughs> Peed on a tree after he set how <laughs> set fire to a house. Okay. He was obviously very drunk. Oh, look at the cows. I'm just gonna take most of this. I feel like we could possibly make a lot of coin by picking up these herbs. I don't know. We'll have to see how much they sell for. What did he get in this boat? Took off his boots and went in the water. Oh. Probably wanted to cover his trail. Smart. Okay. There's a chest here. Oh, a fishing net. I wonder if I can catch fish with that. <laughs> He's catching snails. Um. Let me go back down underneath. Is this something? No. Hmm. Oh, 
there's something over there. Is that a boot? Something jumped out of the rushes. Drowners. But he managed to escape. Oh, drowners. Lost his boots in the rush. Tracks lead back to the village. Lost his boots in the rush. Okay. Freak. Wow. Rude? Bleeding, but not badly. Surface wound. All right. What is this? An inn or like a bar or something? Friends here, but I'll recognize him by his wounds. Mm, okay, so he should be in here, possibly. Why is everything glowing? I guess I can steal everything. <gasps> I don't know if this is okay. It stopped glowing. I thought it was maybe like a bug or something. Here's some beds. Oh, look at the little cradle. There's a lot of food and water in here. I think this was glowing. Oh, I can't take anything. Can I just go into anybody's house and steal all of their stuff? <gasps> Wait, I heard something. Oh. Drowner claw marks. It's gotta be him. Nasty He's wound. our guy. Run into a drowner. What the fuck do you care? Whoa. And he's drunk. Our arsonist's a charmer too. Come on, Smith wants to talk to you. Why not talk to a non-human? Sons of bitches all, and dwarves are the worst. Greedy little magpies do anything for gold. They will. <laughs> they forge the blades the black ones put to our throats. Am I not right? Listen. We can work this out man to man. I give you gold, you don't turn me in. My mum died a while back and I sold her tools. I've spent some, but what's left is yours. Wow, what a character. No chance. You're coming with me. No shot I'm going to let him off. He's being not only discriminating the dwarf, but he's drunk and using his money from his mom's tools to get more drunk. No. No shot. Magpies and dwarves might be greedy, but I'm not. Can't buy me. Then I'll beat your fucking mug to a pulp. I would love to punch you in the face, sir. <laughs> Calm down and come with me. What is this triangle? <laughs> I want to see what that does. Oh, experience points. Calm okay. Down. Now follow me. Mm, Cause I use my Jedi mind trick on him. Okay. All right. Let's escort this very drunk, very awful man is that his wife gotta go what is she doing oh she's scrubbing the floor okay why does everyone here have like the most phlegm i guess it's just like very unclean conditions this guy is so slow i wish we could just pick him up and like throw him on our shoulder Wait, aren't we supposed to go the other way? I think we're supposed to go back the... What do prophesy before he turned his toes up? Uh, was nice. Maybe not. Oh, no, no, no. The marker is this he way. Is okay. It's going to take all day. Make me a Come hunt bears. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Can we just knock him out and bring him with us? <laughs> Holy. Oh, you walk. I'm walking forward, sir. This guy. I guess we can check out the town board. He'll probably catch up <laughs> when we get there. <laughs> oh my goodness. Any man refusing to comply with the order will be... Mm, okay. What are these? Volunteers, death to invaders, the new order. Lend me a plow. Mine smacked up against a stone in the field. Um, We'll take this one. 
Maybe we can read find a plow. What? What do you say? Who taught you that? Uh, All right, we're almost there. Listen carefully. You're never to sing that rhyme again. Never. And you're not to play with Chetty no more. Sorry, lady. Chetty's my best mate. Chetty's a little fool who could get us all killed. I see you with him again, and you'll regret it. This town. These poor kids that are growing up here. Goodness. I can't wait to see the next places that we're going. I mean, this is very nice. The Well, not nice, but it's a very, like, run-down villagey area. I'm excited to see where else. Like, what other places we're going to venture to. I'm sure wherever um, Yen is hiding out will be a better place, hopefully. May the sun shine upon you. Get out of my sight, not... All right, we brought him back five years later. <laughs> Up and at him. Hmm? What? what? What's going on? Here you go. One village pyromaniac in the flesh. <laughs> Nap. You! I knew your mom for years. Charged her nary a copper. This is how you repay me. I've had enough. Hey, soldier. A minute of your time, please. No. Oh, he's going to turn him in. I beg you. I, 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 I was drunk. I didn't know what I was doing. I've told you, Master Willis. He knew what he was doing. Help you rebuild once reinforcements come. The supplies have been ordered. Not what this is about, mate. This here's the arsonist. A witcher found him. The forge was important to the garrison. Destroying it was sabotage. No trial needed here. Just a tree. <gasps> They're going to hang him just right off the bat? Wow. Um, villagers will love you now. I'm going to say harsh punishment. Harsh as punishment goes. But deserved. You I know, guess. I hated the black ones at first. Like everybody just like else lock did. him up? Now I'm thinking they might just bring order to this place. Teach these layabouts some manners. But enough about that. Your reward. And... I managed to save some things from the fire. Anvil still holds, so I'm sure I can bang something out on it. You need anything, let me know. Give you a good price. Okay, well that's nice. So now he'll be able to make us some some weapons, possibly. And we have a point available. A return customer. Welcome. What can I do for you this time? Um, let's see. Let's see what he can craft like with what we have. Something for me. He gave us 20 crown. <laughs> it's not much. So what do we need for this? Some wire and leather leather scraps. Okay, we should probably try to make some of that. What are these? Just crafting components? Okay. Leather scraps. We need leather straps. So very much like Skyrim. This is cool. Um, where's the wire? Do we craft wire or we just find it? Junk. Okay. Let's see what he has for sale. We need two of each, right? Two leather scraps and two wire. And we can make those by using leather straps. Okay. What do you have for sale? Show me what you got. Um, he does have two wire. And he has the straps too. Okay, let's do that. Um, these are 16 each. Let's buy these. Um, 20 coin isn't bad. We'll buy all of them. And what are these? Crafting diagram for some armor. Hunter's trousers, cavalry boots. Lesser glyph of Yerdin. Yerdin sign intensity. You'll be able to craft this item after reading. 67 coin? I feel like we should buy this. Be able to craft after reading. I feel like we should buy that. Okay. So what do I have to do? Read it first? Mm. 
These are like added materials. A better saddlebag. Nice. Maximum inventory weight. It's kind of expensive. All right. Let's see. I wonder if we have to repair. Durability 78%. We might as well repair it. Um, that's the sword that we've been using, right? Yeah, these are ones. Oh, that was okay. That's all right. We just wasted some coin. <laughs> I didn't really see what I was doing for a second there. And we can dismantle some things like we could dismantle this. Oh, we get leather straps, linen, leather scraps. Nice. Okay. It costs some coin, but it's worth it for the items. Amateur armor repair kit. We could dismantle this for some iron and leather. Okay. Mm, we get leather, leather straps through this. Let's do that. I don't know how much we'll need leather straps, so I should probably stop doing that. I just remember needing a lot in Skyrim, but I should probably stop comparing games. Okay, runestone upgrade. Place in the empty slot on a piece of equipment to improve its traits. Okay. So let's have him craft the new... Um, if a craftsman has a component you're missing, you can buy it immediately. Select the item and press... Oh, that would have been nice to know. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, he can craft this now. So oh, let's do that. Nice. We have a better chest uh, leather jacket now. We could have him craft these too. Okay. Maybe some steel while we're here. I don't know if we should turn them into steel plates. I'll wait for a second. Lesser glyph of infusion. Wow, crafting in this game is awesome. There's a lot to learn. Okay, I'm good for now. We'll keep doing some side questing. We'll come back. So long. Put our new stuff on. Oh, so it is already on. He just upgraded it. Okay, nice. Strap trophies to your saddle to receive a bonus. <gasps> That's what it's doing. Okay, so what is the one that we... Because we took the... The Wraith one, didn't we? The Noon Wraith? Mm, okay. So where do I put this? The increase? Place in an empty socket on a piece of equipment to improve its traits. I guess I don't have any sockets on these. Okay. Um, we'll wait to put use that oil. We have some chicken, some water. Use this magic to show the number of cards missing from your collection. Oh, okay. So that tells us what Gwent cards we still need to buy. Okay, nice. So let's go try to pick up another side quest somewhere. There's some herbs over here. I'm just going to grab. He did say something about the herbalist knowing about the wraith. So maybe we should go talk to her. Where's, where's Roach? What happened to your mug? My mug? Is he talking about my face? Here's Roach. Okay. So let's look at the map and see... Maybe I can, like, sell some stuff to her, too. There is a side quest over here. Let me look at my secondary quests real quick. 
Um, complete your collection of Gwent cards. How do I do that? I just buy them off of people, I'm guessing. We could go talk to that lady in the bar. I'm pretty sure that Vesemir is in the bar, so we can do that before we leave. Because maybe we'll have some money. Um, brew a dose of the swallow potion. Once again, Gerald has a near impossible choice to make. A choice between a greater and lesser evil. Oh, that was the herbalist lady. Um, she was treating that girl. A simple peasant woman named Lena. She'd been on her way to meet her lover when the griffin attacked. Okay, so we need to make swallow for her. And then we can go back and talk to the herbalists. So what do we need to make swallow? Need some drowner brain. Let's go try to find some drowners. I'm guessing they'll be by the water. Because that guy got attacked there. So let's go do this side quest and try to find some drowners on the way there. Hey okay. Oh, can't get out that way. Who knows what the morrow will bring? I think it's telling me how to get out of here. The sunsets in this game are amazing. Wait, I have to turn this way. Whoops. Oh, that looks dangerous. Oh. Mm, I went through a puddle and some of the water got on the screen. It's the little things. Oh, am I not allowed this way? Oh, that was strange. Okay. That was very weird. Wait, it switched my quest. Where is it taking me? I want to go this way. Do I have to press enter to track it? Move it. Okay. I think it got me turned around. It is getting kind of dark out, so maybe we could, like, meditate and get our health up a bit. I actually haven't looked at our health. Oh, we're here. Oh, yeah, our health is okay. All right, is this the lady? Lost your key, ma'am? No, not me key. Me pan. Pan? It's always sat there empty, this hut. That is, till the night afore the battle. A man arrived, walked right in like to his own. Was standing by the window, peering at the goings on. He must have heard me, cause next I knew, there he was, coming my way. That's creepy. I grabbed me pan protection see but he just asked so polite gran got any birch bark by chance lilac berries or even a few coals nay says i and you must be right daft to pester folk at night with such foolery but i sees right he like backed away she got closer pan, like oh a magpie at a copper lend it to me gran i'll give it back come morn Battles for what's he doing, brying in the dark. But I've got a soft heart, so I gave it to him. Wow, that was very intense. Fascinating story. Any chance you're nearing the end? Before dawn, another rode up to the hut. But come on, only the first fella left. Locked the door, hopped on his horse, and that were all I saw of him. And me pan. <laughs> Twere old, black with soot, not worth much, I suppose. But I've no other. Will you help me, dearie? Bring an old widower pan. 
I could never break down that door myself. And in truth, I'm afeard to go in any road. Such a stench wafting out. Methinks the other fellow. Well, that he is lying there. Hmm. I'll help you. Never taken on a pan contract. <laughs> Fine, I'll go pan in, contract. look around. You should wait here, All right, just in case. Find this crazy lady's pan. Break into the locked hut. All right. The hut doors won't open. Use your Witcher sense to see if there's anything that you can do. Oh, we can destroy objects. Some objects can be destroyed. Objects are marked with a um, icon to destroy the objects. Face them. Cast the Ard sign. You can also try hacking with them. Oh, hacking at them with your sword. Not everything can be destroyed in this manner. Another option is to toss a grape shot bomb. But be careful. Okay, so Ard. Yep, looks like we can use it. Okay, it worked. I aimed it at the lady, but it worked. <laughs> Bad. Alright, there's uh, some money in here. Some rotting flesh. Oh, okay. Anything else? What's this? A candle. A corpse. Explains the stench. Mm. Yeah. Search the hut and use your... Wait, look around inside for the frying pan using the Witcher sense. Okay. Diagram, Hunter's Gauntlets, Turnout Page, Earth Elemental Doction. Okay. Oh, look at the Gwent cards. Where is that tarot? It looks like Gwent. Some old scars. Kind of soldier might have. What's that, dearie? He Nothing. was garroted. Do you think that she did it? What's that? Here, let's ignite this flame, this candle. Whoops, I didn't mean to hop on there. I just wanted to light the candle. Priceless frying pan. Huh. Scrubbed clean. Hmm. Looks like the mystery man didn't need the pan so much as the soot off it to make ink write letters. Strange. But when I gab to myself, they say I'm going barmy. What are the letters? I want to read what he was writing with a pan. <laughs> What's Documents that? Almost entirely burnt. A few pieces still legible. Burn papers. When you arrange to meet, you show up. I did, risking my life in the entire blasted operation and ended up standing there with my plowing cock in my hands, <laughs> waiting for nothing. I thought the Nilfgaardian army was better organized than that, but you... Illegible. Tell that blast lord general of you, of yours, that me and my companions don't hold grudges, so we won't break off negotiations. But since our old plan's gone, tits up. This time we'll choose the time and place for the next meeting. Okay. Found the pan, have you? That lady is nuts. Is that a oh, okay. Alright, we found your cra your pan, crazy, crazy lady. Here, your frying pan. Mine? But mine were black with soot. And I could see myself in this one if I wanted. But them years are past. It was the soot the man needed. He scraped it off to make ink. Must have had an urgent letter to write. Urgently burned some other documents, too. And... And the other fellow? Dead. Ground up a few boys and buried him outside the village. Deep, so the necrophages don't dig him up. And take my advice. Don't mention this to the Nilfgaardians. Hang about! You've earned a token of thanks. Here, son, for the road. What an interesting encounter. Fry up a nice white fish for supper. Or a pie. All right. 
Uh, nice. So we got some coins, some experience, some baked apples. Okay. So. Ooh, some apple juice too. Let me just search around here and see if there's anything in the area for us. There's another like abandoned house here. Is it abandoned? Yeah. Doesn't look like there's anything in here. Nope. Okay. Okay, so next I think that we should go talk to the herbalist. I wanted to find some of those rains down by the beach. Maybe now that it's dark out, we'll see some more. I don't know. Maybe we have to go like across the river or something. I don't know how far out we can see. Maybe we can just like follow the shoreline. Maybe we'll get lucky and run into some of them. Go, go. We need brains. Those are dogs. Hmm, there's some up there. Okay, let's go get them. You silver. Hmm, that didn't work. How am I not alerting them yet? Why are they running away from me? It's very strange. so weird why are they walking away can i not loot this guy darn i need your brains man where are they going why is that why are they running away from me it's so strange all right there we go. Can I take the brains? Oh, tongue. Let's see if there's any more. Maybe in like the woods area? That's so strange. It was like running away from me. Look at all the hanged people around here. Hmm, there's something over here. What is that? What are those? Like fish or something? I'm scared to look under the water, but I'm curious. Are those the drowners? Can I fight them under here? <gasps> That's a level 10 drowner. I didn't know that they could swim like that. Okay, let's just try to find more over here, I guess. Just need some brains. <laughs> Okay, let's get on Roach and kind of just like run around this area. We have to come across some eventually, right? What is this? Little town area. Okay. Faster. Pretty sure they're like mostly going to be by the water, but maybe they could be in other places too. Oops. Sorry, Roach. Are 
there some over here? I don't see it. Hmm. Take it easy. That's where we fight that fought that griffin. Alright. Well, let's see. Are there any other random side quests that popped up? There's one all the way over here. Let's ride that way. Maybe we'll get lucky and run into some. I wonder if it matters if it's like daytime or nighttime. I feel like I remember seeing some in the daytime. I don't think it matters. Do Wait, that. what's that? What's flowing there? What is this? It's a Mary and Lily key? Hmm. Okay. Cool. There's also something else in here that's glowing. Blood soaked military orders. Hmm. Here, let's get up and read that. To whom it may concern, by order of the Legion commander, the men bearing this massive missive, sorry, are to be escorted north to the border post near Oxenfurt, where they will find a Red Redanian division waiting for them. As noble-born Temerians, they are under special protection, and not a hair on their head is to be harmed. Everything they carry is their own private property and is to remain in their possession. Any failure to heed this order will be punished in acceleration, accelerated mar uh, military tribunal, aka probably getting hanged. <laughs> okay. Cool. I also found some other stuff in there. That's a dead body. Go swimming for a second. That's a death in here. Are those piranhas? Okay. I thought I saw another chest going. Oh yeah, it's here. Nice. Let's go. Harpy diagram. And a new alchemy formula. Let's go. Alright. Onward. That's cool that it showed up on the map. I wouldn't have known to look there otherwise. Okay. So I think we're going away from where we're supposed to go, actually. We want to go this way. I got turned around. Let me make sure I'm going the right way. Yep, just kind of like straight ahead. What are these wolves? Something was... Oh, yep, a wolf. Come on. There's more. I'm pretty sure I want to use steel for these, right? Or should I be using silver for wolves? Are they messing with roach? Don't mess with Roach. Oh, you got me. Come on. Oh, there's more. Jeez. Any more? He's still upset. Hmm. Hmm. 
All right. Is there more? Nope, that's it. Okay. I don't know what we do with dog tallow. Or raw meat. I'm pretty sure... Well, I'm not pretty sure, but I think that you can cook meat. Why else would they give us raw meat? Okay, there's a couple more over here. Ooh, a liver. There's one more over here. Oh, that was a rabbit. We must have run that over on the way here. <laughs> okay, there's one more corpse. Around here. Okay. Faster. Okay, let's eat some chicken. <laughs> Whoa there, Roach. That was a whole thing. We need to make some some potions. We need to make some stuff. Um we need those Perfect. brains in order to make swallow. I wish we could find them. All right, well, we're at the alchemy place. Maybe she sells brains. I don't really want to buy them when we can just go get them. See if there's any water nearby. All right. We'll come back to her after we do this side quest that's up here. I don't want to have to buy brains if we can just find them. Also get fighting experience. Whoa, Who's that? Run, Roach. Is that the hunter guy that we talked to already? Who is this? A merchant? What happened? Monsters. Monsters from the swamp. Folks said the road was fraught with peril, but I wouldn't listen. Got my comeuppance now. Less moaning, more details. What happened, and how can I help? And remember, I don't work for free. Witcher's code and all. Well, was on my way to the Black Ones to trade. Suddenly my horse got spooked, ran clear off the road. We hit a bump. I went flying and the horse and cart rolled on. Then I heard bubbling, neighing, slurping. Something came out from the muck. Devoured Asher, hooves and all. Mm. No doubt my goods are still on the cart. But I'm too afraid to go and see. Thought maybe you? I'm most concerned about a little box. Bring it to me. I beg you. Um, I'll find your box. Fine, I'll go. Let you know if I find that box. He said Witcher code and all for, um, not doing anything for free. And we definitely, the first quest we did today with the Noon Wraith, we did it for free. Is that really Witcher code? Was I supposed to accept payment? Have I already unwitchered myself? All right, let's see. How far away is this? Looks like it's about 380 kilometers. Let's get Roach. I broke the Witcher code already. We won't do anything else for free. <laughs> oh yeah, you guys taught me how to, uh, someone put in the comments about setting fire to the beehive to get the honey. Thank you. Thank you, guys. <laughs> A couple people put in the comments that you could set fire to those. Mm, magic. A place of power. Slow down. Ooh, one ability point. I think that makes two now. I don't believe we the other ability point in there yet yeah we have two now 
So let me look through these real quick. Is there any for like health? That's signs. General. General might be health. I don't think we can just put these into anything though, right? Eating food regenerates vitality. Can I get this one? Oh, I can even. Oh, okay, nice. Each defensive action generates adrenaline points. Bombs. What are these? Hmm, maybe we should do one of these. And I have to put this in a slot, don't I? In order for it to work. Like I actually have to have it there. When do I unlock the next one? Level four, okay. I think the food one will be good to have for now. What is this? Fast attack damage increased by 10. Can we put another point into that one? Okay. We'll start with that for now. Let's go find this box for the merchant. I completely got sidetracked on that. <laughs> okay, we'll go back to this area. All right. Slow now. So this is where his cart overturned. Well, I can use something to break these. Mm, oh, it's explosive. <gasps> Realize that way too late. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right. Let's look very close. Find a little box. All right. Cart tracks. Throw it off into the swamp. I can't believe I just said that. Wow. All right. So it's somewhere in here. Something here. Oh, it's just herbs. Oh, those are the bees. <gasps> Look, some uh, some of those water people. I actually forget what they're called. me out come at me well, they're running away now all right let's eat some eat some food to get some health back oh toxicity the other ones okay there's one more over here mm, they like knock you out all right let's go 
Hopefully that other guy will just leave us alone. Let's see. We can loot some of these bodies and get some brains finally. Nothing. Oh, there we go. Wait, I saw it for a split second. Oh, a tongue. Okay. An ear and saliva. We need more. This is definitely the place to look for these guys. <gasps> brain! Finally! All of that for one brain. I think we need to to make the swallow. Plus, we should probably try to make more. All right, well, here's the cart for our mission. Carts riddled with arrows. Interesting. I should take a look around. Arrows? I thought he said that, and he said his horse was like eaten alive. He said it was a monster. Arrow. Didn't mention this. Hmm, okay. Spain, water. What's this? Locked. Must be that box he mentioned. Splattered with blood. Human blood. Human blood. I feel like he told us that a monster had killed him. What's this? Oh, more bees. Okay. So what are we looking for? We're looking for more evidence, I guess. Let's see. What else is in this area? <gasps> What's that? A dead body? Square in the neck. Good shot. Either the merchant's got serious memory problems, or he's lying. I think he's lying. He said that a monster attacked him. He definitely did. All right, let me see if I can find any more of these... brains, guys, before we go. Because we still need another... We still need another one. And this seems like a good area to find them. Too far afield, this. You reached the world's end. Okay. What's this? <coughs> mm. All right. I guess there's no more over here. We got lucky with the one brain. <gasps> Goodness. It's hard to find the brains in this. I feel like we should have found more. Oh, that's okay. All right. Let's bring go, this guy go. his box back. But I have a feeling he was just lying. And just wanted his box and he actually murdered his guy for whatever this box is but then maybe got scared off by the brain people mm, highly suspect
Oh, and you find the box. Ah, uh, seen through your lies. Yeah, found your priceless chest and someone who looks an awful lot like a cart driver with an arrow through his neck. No dryads in these swamps, and never known a drowner or a water hack to use a bow. So lacking any other suspects, I'm guessing. Watch out! Behind you! There's nothing behind <laughs> me. I'm a witcher, I'd have heard it. Just like I can okay. hear your heart, which is pounding like a liar's. Best oh. hope you're a better writer than you are a liar. He's gonna run, really? Watch out, behind you! <laughs> what a character. Okay, I'm guessing we have to go chase him. He said he hopes he's a better runner. Or whatever. Come on, yep, chase down the merchant. Alright, let's go. What an interesting guy. Oh, let me... <sighs> oh, okay, we got him. Gotta get him out of here. Hmm. What are we hiding the body? W wake up. See. Oh, he's alive. From the truth, not even on horseback. Now, who are you, and why do you attack that card? Private First Class John Gilmer. Temerian 6th Division, 2nd Regiment. Disbanded, but still active. Underground, in the woods. Mm. That was a medical transport. I'd be damned if it reached the Black Ones. And the medicine. Our lads could use it, too. We've many ill among us. You let me go, and they might live. And fight once more for a free north. So he was undercover. Hmm. I feel like I should let him go. Yeah, he just didn't want it to reach the black ones, and he needs it for his, his uh, his crew. Okay, fine. Fine, go. And may you and your soldier buddies hiding in the bushes be victorious in your struggle against Nilfgaard. You have a vile sense of humor, but you're a decent man. Here. The gold I promised. We didn't do it for free. Use it well. We still, we still got Bring gold. To the silver lilies, and to Faltes' memory. All right. Wow, these side quests are very story rich. Like, even though they're side quests, they're full of just entertainment. It's very, very cool. All right. Well, we have one brain. Let's see if we can make Swallow with that one brain. It would be nice to make more, but at least we have at least one. So let's see. We can. Okay, let's go. What's this? Petri's filter? Increases sign intensity. Mm -hmm. All right, let's craft one Swallow. And we'll head back to the alchemist and give it to that lady. Even though I'm pretty sure that... He said that if she drinks Swallow, it could be really, really bad for her, but it could also cure her. Um, I think that we should also make this too. Water essence, honeysuckle. I really love crafting in this game. I think it's really cool. We can make a bomb. Blinds opponents with an explosion. It's like a... A, uh, a blinding bomb. Shrapnel damage to foes. Okay, let's wait until we can make some of this. I'll save the saltpeter for the explosive ones. There's Roach. Oh, he's behind me. Okay. Let's find our... Oh, we're right next to her. Okay, nice. She should be right over here. And then we can give her the swallow and see what happens to the lady. Hopefully she makes it. But that'll be another side quest completed too. Okay. 
yes? Um, I have a potion for Lena. Got a potion for Lena. Swallow. First sign of spring. Symbol of rebirth. Fitting as names go. We'll see. Like I said, could harm her. Deeply. Works on me immediately. But I have a faster metabolism. Effects won't appear in her case for a few days. Why'd you choose this in the end? Decided it was better than doing nothing. I like you, Witcher. Here. A small gift. For giving a damn. Aww. I like her. I like Damira. Oh. Alright, prepare to leave. So that's still our main quest. Let's see if we have any other secondaries. Um, turns out Gerald was not alone in searching White Orchard for a lost loved one. The Witcher also found the notice of a peasant who was seeking his brother. The brother had left home to take arms against the Nilfgaard. The forces of the North and the Black Ones had then clashed in a great battle near the brother's home village. He hasn't heard of his sibling since. Okay. Let's do that one. Maybe we'll have enough money to buy some more, um, Gwent cards. And we can finish up today with a round of Gwent, possibly. Um, what's this one? Treasure hunt. Find the lost Tamirian treasure using your winter sense. Where is this? Suggested level four. What level are we? Three? Okay, we'll do that one when we're level four. This one doesn't have a... Nope. Okay, so let's go find this missing brother. Where is it showing? All the way here. Okay, so let's go to this fast travel point. I'm also going to collect all of her herbs again. Oh no, they're not spawned in. They haven't grown yet. I think there were some outside. I don't know when we'll be back here again. Okay. And we'll go back towards this sign and then just fast travel. I wonder if we fast travel without Ro Maybe I should get on Roach. If I fast travel with Roach, will he come with me? Let's see. Faster. Come on now. Here's the sign. Oh, I can't read it on well, I'm Okay. That's a no. Hopefully he just comes with us. So let's go all the way back to Ransacked Village. I've been really enjoying the side quests. Oh my gosh, they're still alive? Oh no, someone else is crying. Okay. I thought those bodies were crying. It's just this guy. Oh, this is so sad. really sad just gonna pick some berries next to you okay so where are we supposed to go does it tell me over this way okay okay good we still get roach we just have to call him oh no he's stuck in that area it's like all fenced in oh he's fine This is a really sad village. Everyone's dead. The war just like came through. Unfortunate. Do that often? Talk to your dog? It's my brother's, Bastion's. But I guess he's mine now. See, Bastion fought the Black Ones in a battle just outside the village. I haven't had word of him since. I told him, do like I did, lose a finger or two so they won't recruit you. Too damn afeard he was. Bloody hell. He has very large shoulders. Um, walk the battlefield? I'd walk the battlefield if I were you. I did. Sea of corpses. And corpses feeding. 
Someone told me they're afeard of fire, so I took a torch, tried to chase them off. Horseshite, I tell you. Would have ended up eaten alive if it weren't for Hussar here. Listen, mm. guessing you carry those swords for more than show. Come with me. Keep the ghouls off. Help me find Bastion and I'll pay you well. Okay. Fine, I'll help you. Just been a few days since the battle. Chances we find your brother alive or slim. Very slim. I would have thought, but I want to find his body at least. So Bastion don't rot there in the sun with the black ones. Meet me on the hill overlooking the battlefield. We'll move on together from there. Okay. Oh my gosh, he has no pants. Are we supposed to go on foot? Oh, this town. This town is so sad. Everyone's crying and there's death everywhere. It's so many Let's hung go. people. I wonder if I have to be following him. It's fine. We only have like 100 meters left. It just says meet Dune near the battlefield. His dog back there sounds very intense. <laughs> um, okay, I'm just going to keep following him. Are those people on the stakes there? Ah. Oh. His body must be here somewhere. Among countless others. Want to examine them one by one? Could take a while. Yeah. You needn't fret. The recruits from White Orchard painted a small flower on their shields so as to be able to spot each other in battle. There was just a few of them. We look for the flowers, we'll find Bastion quick. I've always no wondered how that. you know who's Man on your side in battle. Shield. Especially if he was on the losing side. If we find the shield alone, Hassan will catch the scent and lead us to Bastion. Come on. The sooner we get this done, the better. Wow. Okay. Um, objectives will sometimes direct you to a general area when the exact position of your target is unknown. Go to the marked area. Okay. We've already experienced that a little bit with the cart guy. All right. So they want us to go this way. I've always wondered, like, with war and stuff, like, how they can tell the difference between um, who is on who. Because, like, tensions must be so high. I wonder how much, um, like, friendly fire happens. Probably a lot. Look for highlighted objects. We can dismantle most of these swords for parts. So this is a good loot run. Would you find tracks or other clues? Walk close, then press E to examine. Okay. That him? No. Neighbor's son. Okay. Come on, Hassar. Can you smell Bastion, boy? Uh, Let's go loot these guys. That. that him? No. 
Draper's son. Come on, Esau. Give me more bastion, boy. Wow, there's a lot of dead bodies here. Goodness. Oh, we'll be able to make a lot of coin here, hopefully. We have all of these swords and just... Mm. What's that? Can I not loot that? Who takes money into battle? Should probably leave your coin at home. Alright, I'm out of the area now. Ashes. Okay. Let's go back over here. That him? No. Doesn't look anything like him. There's another shield over here. Uh, skin's burned off. Come Might on, be hard to tell, I know, small bastion, boy. Could this be him? Still nothing. Nothing? Okay. Quest. Wait, what? Where's the dog? Oh, he's over here. What is he doing in here? But there is more. My lieutenant demanded we defecate on command. Ballista bolts landing all around. And all he could say was, a soldier with a full stomach will not step onto the battlefield. Now, shit. Are they on opposing a sides? Can you believe it? The cretin. Stop. Oh, you're, oh, you're killing me. My, my ribs. Oh, it hurts to laugh. That needs a tourniquet. But first, want to explain what's going on here. Bastion. Is he? Has this milk guardian captured you? No. He saved my life. I, I got a cut to me side and then got hit in the head. Couldn't see anything. Rose in here found me as as he crawled across the battlefield. His legs twisted. And so we were. A blind man leading a cripple. Found this place. Aww. I'm taking you home. We need to see to these wounds. I won't leave Rose in here. I'll own he'll die. And he can't go back to his home. He's deserted. They'll hang him. And what if they find him with us? They'll hang us all, my Laisha included. No, the Blackened stays here. Hmm. If not for him, Bastion be dead. Or your brother is right, it's too risky. I think it's too risky. I mean, they were quick to hang any, they're quick to hang anybody. But maybe we could keep him safe somehow. I hope I'm not getting this guy killed. Bastion only made it with the Black One's help. Maybe you ought to show him Nordlings aren't as barbarous as Nilfgaardians make us out to be. Well, I could give him our pa's clothes, teach him to work the field. That accent. Fine. I'll take him in. Thank you, Witcher. Your reward. And the gods protect you. Oh, he was blind. They didn't know. Well, I mean, the Nilf Guardian knew that he was on the opposing side, but his brother didn't know because he was blind. Humans have compassion, even in the midst of war. It's really sad. Can I talk to them any further? No. I could loot this bag over here, though. Excuse me. <laughs> wow. That was deep. Some sulfur. Nice. All right. Well, we found him. Um, So have your horse come to you. Press X. Okay. All right. Well. We could head back into town now, right? Let me look at my quest again. 
we're not quite level four yet. This one is for the Gwent. Um, so yeah, I think we should probably... Where is this? White Orchards, Marion Valuables. The men bearing this missive are to be escorted north to the border near Oxenfurt. Well, they will find a Redanian division waiting for them. Hmm. Okay. I'm not sure why it's suggested level four. We could go around and like just kind of kill things and get our skill up a bit. But I feel like I should also head back into town. Is there anything out here? I wish we could find some more of those. Um, those sea people. I feel like their brains are really hard to get. Is there a fast travel point over here? No. Well, we could head down by like this river area and see if we can find. Too far afield, this. You reach the world's end. Oh, okay. So we can't go any further over there. All right. Well, let's go see if we can sell th some things to this innkeeper. There was also that um that guy in the town. What town was he in? The one that we helped in the beginning. Here, let's go to a fast travel. So we'll go to Crossroads. I don't think it was in Ransack Town. We'll go to Crossroads and then go over to the Nilfgaardian um, place and get our weapons and sell some stuff and all of that. Because we just found a lot of loot on this quest. Look at this area. gonna cost money to break these down into materials but I feel like it would be worth it okay go up this way here's the fast travel sign Whoa. so let's go back to this milf guardian garrison and we can sell some things we can smith some stuff break down some materials maybe make some coin <laughs> What did he just call me? We're allowed in here, right? Okay. So let's see. There was this armor guy here, quartermaster. Are you here to spy or <laughs> uh, how's morale? Morale holding up around here. You boys think you can win this thing? Ah, a spy after all, or one to stir trouble. Neither. Just curious. Right. Well, tell anyone who cares we will win this war, because Radovid is mad. As everyone knows, and we've an extraordinarily well-drilled and well-supplied army. Incidentally, did you wish to buy something? <laughs> is that a snoring noise? All right, so let's um, do the crafting first. I'd like you to craft something for me. We'll break down some materials. Let's see. Junk upgrades. What do we need for this? A lesser glyph. Steel sword, crossbow bolts, hardened timber. What do we use hardened timber for? Yeah, 
can also make steel plates and string. Let's make some string. And steel plates. Okay. How do I... So these are my equipped things. Let's repair. Repair equipped spacebar. Okay. And let's dismantle pretty much all of this stuff, right? Or is the... Are these swords better than the one I own? What I own? Not really. Okay, so let's dismantle. I feel like it's worth all of the... All of the stuff that we will get. Hang on. Don't dismantle that. I wish there was like a dismantle all button. So is this stuff that he is selling? What's this one? Hmm, a steel sword. How much money he wants? 46. That's actually not bad. Shift to compare. Hmm, we have armor piercing. Okay. This one's better. It's 275. That's literally all of our coin. But maybe we can sell some materials to him to kind of make up for the loss. This is actually a pretty good sword. At least I think it is. Should I buy this? What sword do we have on us now? I feel like I should buy this one. Okay. I don't know why it's telling me how to dismantle things again. <laughs> um, repair. No. I just want to see what sword's on me now. Well, I guess it's... Hang on. Let's go back to the shop. It's the Witcher Silver Sword. Required level one. Yeah, I think we should buy it. Um, Just very expensive. Okay, let's do it. 13 coin. We're broke. We're so broke. Okay, it's fine. All right, let's sell him some things. Let's see what he'll take. What's this? Used to craft gear and items. Venom extract. Monster eye. Um, leather scraps. We could craft this one. Okay. What are we missing for this? The lesser glyph. Okay. Does he sell one of those? No. That other guy did though. That uh dwarf that we helped out in the beginning, he sold that. Okay. So let's go back. Oops. So long. And we'll equip the new swords that we have. 
So we got a new steel sword and a new silver sword. The steel one's actually really nice. Um, I mean, not amazing, but it is much better than the ones that we have. So we could sell these ones to him. Are you here to spy or haggle? Show me what you're peddling. Okay, so we'll sell this one for six coin. <gasps> oh no, I just sold my glyph to him, my runestone. Oh, that's unfortunate. I was on the wrong thing. It cannot be sold. Okay. Yeah, everything else I kind of want to keep. Hopefully we'll just get some more coin as we go. Um, I don't really know what materials are really helpful right now, so I want to keep all of them. I don't want to accidentally sell something that we could use. I will sell these, though. Resistance to pierce, slashing. Mm, that's okay. Okay. So long. All right. Replenishing items. Oil, potions, and bonds, bombs are consumed upon use and can run out. You replenish your stocks, enter the meditation panel. If you have hard alcohol in your inventory, it will automatically be used to create a new batch of every alchemy item you have. Interesting. Okay, that's good to know. All right, let's enhance our stuff. Um, What was the other one that we could use? I think it was this table over here to help repair our armor or something or enhance okay nice all right let's go back down to the fast travel and then we can go to the bar and talk to the bar lady maybe oh we're broke now we can't buy any gwent cards if we're broke <laughs> i was gonna go buy some gwent but we are very poor now, unfortunately. And I think the Gwent cards are kind of expensive. I believe she was selling them for like a hundred a piece, I think. We meet again. Thank you for saving me. People say all kinds of things about witches, but I've always known yours to be an honorable guild. So you managed to salvage some goods? Yes. But I await the repair of my wagon. As time passes, my losses grow. Do you need something? I I'll let it go half free. 50% <gasps> off. What are you offering? Let me have a look at your stock. <clears throat> he has Gwent. And it's 50 coin. Can we sell him anything? Any like herbs or... Honeycomb kind of sells for a bit. Wait, is that 20 coin? Oh, no, no, no. It's two each. Okay. Let's see. Do we have a lot of anything that we can give him? How much are these? Leader type, unit, five, four, and eight. I think we should buy the eight one. We should buy the catapult. Um, he's next to a car with the same. Let's buy this one. We're just spending all of our money on Gwent. And you have that one. This one's 20. I feel like we should buy it. Oh my gosh. And we need to sell something to get this one. Um, do you want some of my... Hang on, which ones? Do I feel like we don't... Griffin feathers are probably important to keep. We can always get some more mushrooms. Let's sell these. We need 10 more coin. Let's sell those and those. I blame not selling anything important. You guys are probably going to yell at me. <laughs> she sold all of her good stuff for Gwent. All right, let's do 10 of those. All right, we have 54. We're good. We can buy this card. 
<gasps> a satchel. Okay, we'll have to come back to this guy if we can. We have like no money. We got four coin in our name. Take care. Do we have to pay money to play Gwen? I don't remember. Let's go see if this guy's in here still. There's Vesemir. Where's our Gwent guy? Oh, he doesn't want to play. All right. Well, we'll play more eventually, I'm guessing. Is there anyone else in here? Nope. Okay. I was going to play a round of Gwent before we left, but it doesn't look like our guy is here. But <laughs> next time we will definitely play some Gwent with our new cards. We sold all of our money to get three cards, but that's okay. Um, yeah, today was an awesome day. I'm glad that we were able to do some of the side questing around White Orchard. I'm pretty sure that was like most of them. So I think next time we'll just be ready to uh, go talk to Vesemir and hopefully we'll be able to run into Yen and actually get to see her character again. Thank you guys for suggesting to hang out in White Orchard and just kind of like take my time with the game. I've been enjoying it a lot so far. I don't know what I expected from the side quest, but I was very um, happily surprised that the side quest is actually amazing in this game. And it felt like I was kind of just going along with part of the story as well. I'm glad that we were able to actually feel more like a witcher today and um, even put some oil on our blade, um, buy a little bit too much Gwent and increase our weapons that we have. So hopefully next time we hop in, um, we can get started in the main storyline and go meet up with Yen. Thank you so much for um, all of the subs and all of the comments. Is there's anything that you guys want to see differently? If my camera is in a weird place, I am open to all suggestions. So leave them in the comments below. I take time to read them and sometimes respond to them. And thank you so much for all of the love. I'm looking forward to the next one. Bye everyone.